All right, so, hey. So here we are with Citizen Media News. That's my little uh, media empire. Um, so, and I am here with the, the, why is this thing not? Patriots. The Patriots. Yes, and, and as a CW, former CW3, I know what a Patriot looks like. So what, first names, what's your first name? Jack. 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 William Hutchins. Eshawn. Hugh. Jack. Kenan. There's two Jacks? Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. So you 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 go to uh, UNC. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And you guys are the ones that save the flag. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. So, like, which one of you guys is the alpha male? Which one's your spokesman? Who does? This is our spokesman. I don't know. Oh, about oh, yeah. oh, yeah. yeah. oh, he's the best speaker. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, actually, he's probably the best speaker. Oh, he's the best speaker? He's our speaker. Not, 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 alpha, not alpha male, male but definitely the best speaker. But, but he <laughs> talks. So, what happened? Uh, I know you probably during know. the last day of classes when you, the, flag, the flag. I mean, I was coming back from um, one of my last classes of the day, and we're walking through campus, and I saw uh, the protesters all gathered around. So I found some of the guys that I knew in the crowd, and um, we watched them start to take the flag down. And it was more of like a knee-jerk reaction more than anything. I think the biggest thing is that you know none of us really wanted to take away like oh like. We can get credit for this or we can you know get something out of this it was more just this is inherently wrong you know it's the place that gives you the opportunity to speak your mind and the place that gives you the opportunity to say whatever you might want to say and disrespecting it um the symbol of what gives you that freedom yeah. it, it's like it, it i don't know so we just went in and yeah. we held up the flag because that's just disrespectful I was coming back from class. I just got out of my last day of class, and I saw Alex, who just spoke, mm -hmm. at the flag, and I saw a group of maybe, like, I don't know, at the time, probably 12 guys only. It, it, it expanded through time, and I went over there immediately because I see the flag was completely down, and we go, and we hold it up naturally just because, you know, we're at our college campus. I mean, politics aside, we love our country, and we don't want to see our flag being taken down yeah, I mean, for a Palestinian flag. Yeah. I mean, I just don't think that's right. You got to be grateful for what you have here in this great country. Yeah. So I think we all agree with that. Same thing. I came straight from class. Yeah. As soon as I heard what was going on, I just saw my friends there. I support America, and I supported the flag. So of course I would do whatever I can to support my country. And yeah. do I just got home morning. I've been. I was uh, turkey hunting that morning. Came back and took a nap. Then Tyler <laughs> called me. Turkey hunt. <laughs> Tyler called me. He's like, Hey, did, come did to the flagpole. Not that morning. So another <laughs> call me. I went back to the flagpole. So, they're trying to, so you're a Second Amendment guy too. Huge Second Amendment guy. Well, they were trying to take the flag down. They wanted to stomp it into the mud, set it on fire. Well, once I knew that was going on, I wanted to go back and make sure that didn't happen. So yeah, I went out with all my friends, and I mean, we were all in UNC Pika, and went out there and just made sure that didn't happen. I think the biggest thing really was that you know, in the moment, nobody was really thinking about you know, I'm nobody was really thinking about oh, like it, it's it shouldn't be a political stance to be able to nobody was thinking about like um like we didn't think anything I got, oh, I got, I got are, 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 are you are, are you guys really surprised that the we, we, we had no it? idea yeah, this I mean, was gonna be yeah. oh we're gonna end up at the rnc and have yeah. all this attention I mean, we really just in the moment i think it was more like just did this it is our flag yeah. i love my country i'm so grateful to be here i feel and the same way I mean, I think, and when there's people disrespecting our country blatantly and they're just not grateful for the opportunity they're given then I feel like yeah. we, we just naturally just felt like I mean, I this feel is like, just wrong. I feel like protesting like makes America what it is, but if you're going to disrespect the symbol that allows you to protest, then at that point it's no longer a protest. It's, right. You can't take down it's the thing beautiful. that protects I mean, all your all rights. We all support to, the right to protest. To put up a flag freedom of speech, of course, but when it comes to the American flag, we will uphold that and support our country no matter what. I think Hugh and Jack hit it exactly on the head. It shouldn't inherit... It's sad that it has to become a political issue to love the place that you're from. I mean, I think that, you know, you should be proud and patriotic of wherever you're from. But I don't think that means necessarily being, you know, blindly supporting wherever you're from. You should obviously be critical of whatever you love because you can't just love something blindly, right? Right, right, right. But at the end of the day, being able to be love your country and still be critical of it is an important skill. And that shouldn't be um, a political stance. I mean, we're really grateful to be out here, and we're really grateful to be invited out here, but at yeah. the end of the day, we just did what we thought was right in the moment. Yeah, I think, I mean, we would have done that regardless of whether we would have got this attention or not. All this, you know, we 
We would have done that regardless. The attention is secondary. Dude, hey, comes wait, I've got one more country. question. Come here. Sorry. Come here. Are any guys, are you, are you come from military families? My dad uh, is well, in my the My grandfather was on both sides of the family. He served in the military, yes. Yeah. So that was definitely one of the biggest things why I felt the disrespect of our nation symbol was God. very disrespectful. Do, do uh, Are any of you guys planning going into the military? Um, I do think it's a noble thing. However, I myself am not personally. But... Real quick, what's your majors? Uh, business. Uh, business. <laughs> business. Business. Computer science. Business. Business. All right. Hey, well, last question. I'm going to ask you this. What's tying in with what you guys were just talking about? This is a really cool thing. I used to teach military science. What's the purpose of the military? To protect our country, no matter what. Not close. But what it's what is it really there to protect? Protect American citizens. Nope. Protect, protect Western serve. values. What? Protect and serve. Nope. Western values. What is it? Protect What's the Constitution. Thank you, dude. There you go. <laughs> what is the oath of office that we take as a, uh, as office? I I do solemnly swear to protect and serve to protect the Constitution against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Right. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. So, and that's basically what you kids are doing. That's what you guys were doing out there when you you stood up and you protect that flag. And as a retired Warren officer, I got, dude, I'm so proud of you guys. I'm so proud <laughs> you guys are from North Carolina. You know, and, and look at it this way, too. I, I, I don't know how many friends I've lost in combat and helicopter crashes and stuff like that. And what you did, I, I mean, honors them in a way. And, and you guys had no way of knowing this, like you said. So thank you so much. And uh, I won't keep you any longer. No, thank you. It's great to be Thank you so much. Yes. I'm glad you much. that you feel that we supported the troops. Yeah. I mean, at the end of the day, we know people sacrifice a lot for this nation. So. All right. Take care, guys. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.